Always, right? All right, good morning. Ellie, Cleo, Tracy, Carol, we'll start with some. Oh, my upper body is definitely a bit more sore. Um, from, and we're going to do this part today towards the end. Lindsay's push up plank combo. And it's, I'm feeling it from two, what's today? Thursday from two days ago. So you're all, if you weren't there Tuesday night, you'll get in on the magic here. We got Tracy and Marie, Carrie, Aaron, Mary, Suzanne, Brittany, Steph, Susan, Lily Lou, who's up. Judy coming in, Liz, Amy, Letty, Mariana, I'm not done. Awesome. You guys, you ladies do not slow down. I love it. Charging hard, strong, committed. It's part of our day, right? This is part of just who we are. We wake up, we work out. It's our stability, our anchor in these crazy, crazy times. We got Katie, Kristen, Lenny, Lawrence coming in. All right. Let's go ahead. Cross body, Casey. I see you. Step punch, step punch. We're just warming up and then we're going to be doing strength training. Uh, usually we do mostly weights in circuit class. We're going to do a little bit of body weight in that one set. It's a killer five minute plank and push up set and I'll do that towards the end. This is recorded so you'll be able to catch it later too if you can't make it to the end of class. Uh, we got Suzanne in the house. Casey, Amy, G, three, changing the baby. Two, one. Okay, let's just jog it out in place. Just get that blood pumping if you haven't um if you haven't done your cardio yet some of you probably came from cardio shred just again jogging in place <sighs> feel that blood start to flow through your body wake yourselves up five and we'll pick up the weights four three two one all right we are actually going to start she's here in the house too with lauren set um or most lauren set I'm going to kind of mix things up. So focus today is more on the upper body. We will definitely get in some core. Um, we'll find a way to add some squats in as well. Get some music. So your strength, your, if you're playing music, my playlist for your strength work definitely has more of a kind of like fiery feel, right? What's the kind of music that's going to um, pick you up? So we're going to start with the right arm crossed over the left. I love this one, Lauren. I want to start right here with the cross body pulse. And I want you to exhale as you pull the weight up and it comes right up into your shoulder, into your armpits. We're all working hard for our Lindsay arms this month. Timer's on. Linda's giving Team Awesome a shout out. Amanda's in the house. Who else just popped in that I missed? Demetra, good morning, Mariana. So 30 seconds, squeeze. Where'd my music go? Here we go. 10 seconds, then we'll switch the top arm. Five. Good. It feels nice. Two, two, one. Okay, now the left arm comes on top. Same move. Squeeze. Bring it down. Squeeze. And then check in on your posture. Nice and tall. Little bend in the knees. And this week for our um, focus in my Never Miss a Monday show, we talked about the importance of strength training. So important. Um, strength training is a huge piece of the fitness puzzle. And what lean muscle does is it makes us healthy. It makes us functionally fit. Three, two, one. Now we're gonna come onto our right leg. A little bit of balance as we take it to an overhead press. So, I always love to remind ourselves that muscle is a workhorse. It loves to be productive. It loves having something to do in the body. And that job is to be your protector, right? It protects your bones, your organs, your ligaments. It fights out uh, disease, sickness, germs, all that kind of good stuff. So your immune system is greatly improved the more lean muscle you have on your body. Switch sides. So this, super. Productive class. Oh man. Uh, oof, I'm not balancing your team. 10. I'm back to altitude, so I'm going to be breathing heavier back here at, I don't know, what's Crowley? 7,000 feet? Four. There you go. Nice, Cleo. Yes, Ellie. Beautiful, Tracy. Three, two, one. Okay, we have a couple different kinds of curls coming up, starting with the regular bicep curl. 
And if you have a couple sets of weights and you want to go a little heavier in the bicep, totally good. Nice Suzanne. Who's outside? Rizzy's always outside. I love it. Tracy H. And Marie's outside. I should be out. I could, I should do. Nice Lauren. I was like, you are somewhere different. Lauren's up in Chico too. You should go see Tracy and Brianna and Lou's in the house. Nice. Cassie. Woo. Down and up. Those weights should be getting heavier. Got 10 more seconds. Let's look at 30. 66 in this room. Five. You are meeting Tracy. Yay. Four. I guess she's on your team too, right? Three. You got it, Letty. You're strong. Two. One. Okay, now we're going to switch that to a hammer curl right here. As I always joke around, we don't get Lindsay arms by looking at them. Yeah, nice, Kathy. We have how many three mother daughter duos in the house this morning? Boom, down and up. Down. We train, right? So you can lift your own suitcase or unload those pallets of sod. Or um, I, it was actually funny. Tracy uh, a shared yesterday how the guy at Costco noticed her beautiful shoulders and strong shoulders. And you guys, be proud. I know it sounds kind of silly, but. Um, I was saying, I guess that's a side effect. We have to wear a mask everywhere, right? So then now you're going to have more attention drawn to your arms. So another good, yes, Susan, I knew you'd like that one. Another good reason to be working the arms right now. Not everyone's going to see your beautiful smile as much. They can see your beautiful, strong arms. Yeah, Cleo, ooh, team, you're going strong. Three, two, one. Okay, the weights come up. Lap pull down. We're going to come out. Two. Three, bring it all the way back in, press it back up. So as if you're just pulling yourself up a pull, press it back up. So take a little break. Two, three, press it back up. Woo! I believe there are two more moves in this circuit from Lauren, but we're gonna be getting those moves in. Um, some of the next upcoming sets. Oh, 15 seconds and we'll take a little water break. Hydrate, talked about, um, definitely, we might feel a little tighter this month in our upper body. We've been training um, pretty focused up here. So make sure you're stretching, you're hydrated. Hydration is a key to not feeling sore all the time. Three, two, one. Oh, quick sip of water. And also nutrition, right? If we have excess inflammation in the body, too much sugar, stuff like that's going to keep us constantly sore. Uh, okay, next set. Okay, we're going to do uh, uh, Maria. I like this one. We'll start with, I'm going to go up a little heavier. I'm going to go crazy. <laughs> I get be safe. Um, we're going to start with the weight in our left hand. Little turnout. Got Maria's sister in the house. I love it. All right. We're going to take a little bit of a swing. So we'll get a little bit of a plie here into an overhead press right here. We'll start on this left side. When you're ready, one minute on the clock. Down. Nice, Carol. Perfect. With control. Down. Bring it in. Up. Nice. Straight spine as well. We're not hinging the hips back. We're coming into that plie. And then use that core. Use the strength from your lower body to press that weight and get those shoulders going. Halfway. Yes, Steph, that looks awesome. Brittany. Awesome. Erin. Yes. Lenny Lou who in the pink pants. I like it. Lenny. Lots of pink today. Bring it down. And up. 10 seconds left on this side. There you go, Amanda. Beautiful. Beautiful, Mariana. Strong. We are covering the whole US here today and up to Canada. Four. Unstoppable. That's it, Katie. Tammy's in the house. Noreen, Stacy. Good morning. Two, one. Okay. Now the um, right foot, I'm still having the weight in my left hand. I'm going to go down to a little bit lighter weight here. 
I'm gonna row, take it to a lateral lift. We don't need to go higher than our shoulder. Row, lateral lift. Woo, yeah, beautiful, Emily. Row, lift. And if that lift is too much, just stay with the row the whole time. Your shoulders are not having it. Row, lift. And how I'm seeing it, I'm feeling it myself. I see it in all of you. Um, we've been focusing now, it's been I think four weeks, we started a little early on this extra upper body training. And this is when the results, right? This is when we start to feel and see that hard work starting to pay off. And that's the other thing with strength training. You gotta be really patient. Uh, it takes a while for your body to adapt and transform. Three, two, one. Okay, same moves, other side. Grab the same weight you had, the little swing to press. Swing, press. Bring it down. Woo! Feeling good, right? Getting our mojo for the day. Your strength. What are you going to have to be strong for today? Maybe you don't even know yet, right? Life's pretty good at throwing us curveballs these days. That's what we're training for to handle them one at a time. Right here, the focus to your health, your well being, your strength. Oh, look at everyone. Awesome. What are we up to this morning? Nice, Tammy. Beautiful. 34 in circuit training this morning. That is. Something to next, Amy. Four, three, two, one. Okay, now the uh, left leg comes forward, right toes turn out, so long spine. That row to lateral lift. Row, lateral lift. So from the side, my back foot's turned out, spine is long. Do not let your shoulders. Drop, row, the arm's the only thing moving. Tight row to the lateral lift. Nice, awesome, Aaron. And then look for it. I see a couple heads starting to drop. Um, oh, you can see my roots. And I'm not getting back to the hair salon anytime soon. <laughs> so <laughs> we'll keep working those arm muscles because those are something we can work on, right? Those are not closing. Woo, gotta have fun. Five. <laughs> awesome, Stacy. You get it. Three, two, one. All right, pick up your weights. We got a little tricep set here. So we're going to kick back three times. One, two, and then on the third one, you're going to pulse. One, two, three. Pull it in, next Lenny. Woo, one. Elbows in, two, last one, three, one, two, three, and just a little plug. Um, if you're doing the six month challenge, it's a totally optional, but those team shirts are for sale. I think today's the last day to order. And um, it's a really good memento you'll have at the end and then you'll be able to spot your teammates um, that are in the same shirt when they wear it. It's really fun. I still have my team shirt from last year. I usually go with the first team I coach. So this year it'll be, I got, I got the resilience shirt. One, two, three, in, and out. And, the more, and even more special this year, Christine is now making all of our swag. So Christine hand makes all of these shirts for us, um, which makes them even more special. She always packages them super cute and her prices are always, she sells them for like 20 bucks. I think these were 23 with shipping. Woo, one more. Press it back, one. No, not one more, sorry, we got two more. We're not gonna shortchange these triceps, one. Two. Yeah, nice, Kathy. Kristen, three, one, two, three. Okay, one more, woo -hoo. And we'll take a little break and we'll take halfway done with class right now. Two. Yeah, nice, Suzanne, hold it back, one. Two, three, hoo -hoo. all right. Water or ponytail break, it's time. And I had to wash my hair yesterday, which I never do on a Wednesday. But I, I flew when I was in an airport and I figured I might as well. 
squash. Nice. Oh, Liz, look at your back. You just turned around. I just saw some amazing back muscles. I love it. Everyone feeling strong? Seriously, everyone looks so fit and healthy. Yes, own it, team. Own it. Um, all right, come up to your screen real quick. We have a little break. Give me one power word that motivates you. Uh, a word. It doesn't, there's no right or wrong answer. We're going to shout out these words to keep us going strong. What's the word? It can be your team name. All right. Give me a word. Come on, there's 33 of us. Don't be shy. We're all friends around here. All right, next step. We'll go to Leslie's step. So, oh, <clears throat> this is, we'll probably be actually on Sunday or Saturday in school to stretch. I'll try to catch up on Wednesday. So yesterday, Bridget's um, set, I haven't got to catch up on today and tomorrow. So if you're coming to sculpt and stretch on Saturday, we'll catch up on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So just coming to these classes, you're doing the monthly challenge. Okay. We're going to take a wide uh, row, then you're going to rotate the palms towards each other, narrow row, then you're going to stand up. <laughs> I got my shirt, upright row. So wide row. When you're ready, you gotta use your brain a little bit. Narrow row, upright row. A little different than the cross. We'll keep the weights parallel to each other. All right, yes, thank you, ladies. Power words, I love power words. Boom, yes, Amanda. What do we got? Oh, that's a good one. All right, I'm gonna go through these throughout class. Maybe, ooh, grind, I like it right off the bat. That's a word, see, and thank you. That's a word I need to use more. We are grinding, rise and grind. Good one, Ellie. Right? Wide. Narrow. Stand up. Row. About 20 more seconds. All right. I got to get to the top. There's so many. You guys are amazing. All right. Starting with a very important word, one of the team names too. Um, do you have the perseverance, right? The strength the grit to pull through on, especially those days you don't feel like it. Perseverance is a good trait, um, reserved for the select few, right? Who don't give up. All of you, three, two, one. Okay, next one, we're gonna take lateral lift to the front, to the side, then we're gonna take it again into an overhead press. So a little bit of shoulders here. Lateral front. Don't go higher than your shoulders. Side. Bring it in. Press it up. Ooh, that feels good. Nice, Judy. Awesome, Mary. You got your don't wish for it shirt on. All right, teamwork. You guys know there is no I in team. It really is teamwork makes the dream work. Surround yourself with good teams, your fitness team. Hopefully, you're working you have a solid work team or at least a couple people that are on your team that bring joy and positivity and then your family is a team your friends you got a lot of opportunities to create big important teams in your life so important Whew. this one being one of my favorite ones my bfit team Whew. out bring it in bring it up ah uh, yes nice carol Tracy. All right, got more perseverance. That must be the word this week, this morning. Yes, resilience. What is that? I love that word. I use that one a lot too. I probably use resilience and awesome the most. Um, are you resilient? When things try, keep trying to knock you down, take you out of the game, push you over, push you back, are you resilient enough to charge through, to keep going? Yes. Woo, taking care of yourself makes that so much more possible. Three, two, one. Okay, now we have a three-part si uh, three curl. So we're gonna come with a regular bicep curl, then turn the weights, hammer curl, then take the elbows to the side, W curl. So bringing the elbows in, regular, turn the weights up, hammer. This one's from Leslie, this is a fun little one. We're getting three parts to each move. Ooh, bring it back in. Up, 
Okay, 10 minutes left. We still have that push up round. Yes, live. Do you live each day, right? It's today, right? That's what we're. I love that one. That has been a huge lately. Like, so with so much uncertainty and things changing, what if, what if right now, this is what you get to focus on? What a gift. And as we know, because of our resiliency and all those other words, whatever, we can get through. We've done things we didn't think we were even capable of to now. Woo! Take it out. Three, two, one. Okay, we're going to go through those one more time. Ah, here we go. So the wide row, narrow row, upright row. So little hinge when we take it to that wide. That one always messes my brain up. There we go. Wide, narrow, stand up, high. Nice, Erin. Beautiful, Brittany. Texas in the house. It's nice in Texas. Yes. No, you're outside, so it's got to be somewhat nice. <laughs> Liz, my, my name's your power word. I love it. Rise. Rise. That's important. You even show up. You got to rise, right? You got to get up. You got to show up. That's a good one, Kathy. I like that. Rise. You're going to rise to the challenge. Are you going to rise up on the days? You just straight up don't feel like it for no good reason other than you just don't feel like it. Here we go. That's not a good enough excuse. Squeeze. Let's go one more. One more time through those three. Where are we at? Okay, here we go. Why? This one definitely gets me mentally. Narrow, upright. Okay, then we have the laterals. Woo! So if you want to do one arm at a time, you can. Don't go higher than your shoulders. And then we bring the elbows into the body for that upright press. Overhead press. Nice man. Awesome, of course. And I say that word, right? We got to believe we are. We are all awesome. Even if you're not on Team Awesome, you're on Team VFit, which makes you awesome. Strong. Boom. Not just physically, right? Mentally. Grounded. Strength comes right from your values, your core values, things that will not change about you, that make you who you are. Yeah, Mariana. Boom. Looking good, Lenny. Beautiful. Kristen. I said grind. I love that one, Ellie. Got some more. Strong, right? Strong, man. That's a good one. Powerful. That's what Lauren's coming at. Powerful and focused. They can go together. With great power must come great focus. I was reading in my Todd Durkin book about, you know, a lot of ways to get focused and stay focused. That's really hard. Focus is uh, so many things going on. Three, two, one, and then here we go. Last time through. Curl, hammer, take it out. We got the finale coming, team. Coming up soon. Regular curl. Thanks, Katie. Hammer curl looking strong. I'm seriously, thanks, Amy. You all, your arms. All right, happiness. Yes, Carol, that is such a good one. We cannot rely on um, happiness. So much of that is on you, right? You create happiness for yourself. You cannot expect others. You create it by who you're surrounded with, right? Who you choose to be with, the type of things you allow into your brain, into your heart, into your body. Um, so happiness <clears throat> is in your control. And it doesn't mean it's always easy. And even us trainers, we're not always perfectly happy. Go lucky, my husband will vouch. <laughs> Four, three, two, one, some more strong coming. I like that one. All right. <clears throat> we have our last <clears throat> set. My foot's so good. Coming up. You're in luck because we're not going to get to do the whole thing. I, I, um, this is the plan. We're going to do three minutes. So it's going to be 30 push ups. And it, um, we're going to start <clears throat> with plank taps. So your feet are nice and wide. Shoulder taps right here. You can be on your knees. <clears throat> if you're on your toes, get those feet wide so you're not rolling around. You can also. So stand up. So right here, 30 seconds of plank shoulder taps. Yep. <clears throat> and good one to end on. I love that, Anne-Marie. Progress over perfection. Uh, so important, right? Many people 
aren't even working out right now because they don't think it's the right conditions to even begin. They're like, I don't know what they're going to wait for, but, um, you know, it's about every step, one, that 1% 1 better every day. 1% is doable, right? We have five, four. I want your push-ups right now to be 1% better. You're working on progress. Two, one. Okay, take your arms a little bit wider than your mat. 10 push-ups on your toes, on your knees, against the wall. Two. So lead with your heart, not your head. Lead your heart centers you down and up. Yeah, Carol. Awesome, Aaron, those look amazing. Carrie, gorgeous, Anne Marie, Tracy. All right, two, everyone get 10, one. Next plank we have is plank up, down. So we come down, down, up, up. We can do these on their knees. This is a, a three minute set team. We're almost halfway done. Or we can do these prayer pulses. These are always a good option in the up, down. Whew. Five. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I'm gonna drop to my knees for this next set. Chaturanga push up so the elbows press into the body. One, two, three. Again, you're lowering your chest. Maybe you're gonna go a little smaller. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Strong. What are those words you can rely on right now? Two, oh, hi, Kylie. One, and then our last one, we're going to come down to low plank here. And let's take some plank rainbows, right? Center, final minute team, left, center. Woo! I've been missing circuit. I don't know what, I feel like it's been a couple weeks since I've been on teach this class. We can always take it right here. Awesome. awesome, Linda. See, that's how you got that name. I must have, how many times do you think I've said that over the years? So each of those, yes, Brittany, those look amazing. Mary, three, two, is that Jenna hopping in? Two, one, and then this time we're going to take the fingers into a diamond, put them right under your heart, and the elbows come out. One, two, three, if this feels like too much, four, you can take it right here. Five, press. You're still going to feel this. Six, seven, yeah, team. Unstoppable is what I would say right now. Nine, ten. Oh, when you get to your ten and you realize, okay, that's showing me I definitely need to stretch more today. Oh, I have to admit, I've been doing really good at my stretching in my unwind classes. Huge difference I can feel in the body. So if you're constantly feeling sore, you got to check in. Are you doing enough stretching? Are you doing enough recovery? Are you eating well? Are you hydrated? Um, you can't just put the work in and not do the other side of it. The recovery is huge. Oh, nice. Texas is representing this morning. We got Brittany, Casey, Tracy R. Two, one. Okay, cross that arm over. If you got time, team, we have a little bit of a break. Um, and then roll the wrist. Cardio shred. So I promise your day will be more amazing. It will just from this class, but cardio will take it to the next level. And then switch to the other side. Just stretching the back of that arm. Well done, team. And then maybe just reach up, open that chest up a little bit. Nice, Sammy. Awesome. All right, show off those guns, team. Like I said, if maybe everyone can't see your smile as much right now. They can see your hard work and beautiful arms and shoulders. And here we can see each other's smiles as much as needed. Um, so five minute break. I'll just keep the class open. We are going to do um, Three Emons, and if you don't know what that is, you'll have to stick around for cardio shred. Three Emons is the workout. Bye, Letty.